Dr. Gilly Regev, the founder and CEO of Sanitize, joins us now from Canada. Dr. Regev, why do you think the Sanitize product can kill the coronavirus? Why do I think? I don't think. I know it kills coronavirus. The, we, we have done studies, we have looked and studied it in, in our lab and in other labs externally that show that actually when you put sanitized liquid, the nitric oxide releasing solution, together with the virus for a very short time with the SARS-CoV-2 virus, it kills it. Within two minutes, it gets complete kill of the virus. COVID-19 has only been with us for a few months. How was Sanitize able to develop this treatment so quickly? The Sanitize has a platform technology, and this platform can treat all kind of topical diseases and upper respiratory diseases. We always had this nasal spray for flu prevention on our platform technology, but it wasn't the priority. We were working on chronic sinusitis and diabetic foot ulcer, onychomycosis. And when this just started, everything was on hold. And then we decided that we quickly pivot and develop this treatment for COVID and do a quick clinical trial. How is the treatment delivered? How do we actually use Sanitize? It's a simple nasal spray. And you can see just a simple nasal spray that you can spray in your nose together with a nasal lavage, a nasal rinse. It's very simple. Everyone can do it at home. You can do the nasal spray during the day when you're at work. Every time when you think you may get infected, you can use it or early on on the disease. And are you suggesting that with sanitize, we won't need masks or gloves or hand washing or social distancing? We can simply inhale the virus and then kill it? It sounds a bit risky. The that's exactly what it is. It's, it's your hand sanitizer for your nose. So when you go outside, you use hand sanitizer, you will still use the hand sanitizer, but then you will use this nasal spray to sanitize, to kill the viruses in your nose if you get infected. So this is what I'm suggesting. And in terms of frontline workers at the moment, is this an extra layer of protection that they can have, as well as the masks and the other things they're using? Yes, exactly. Until this has all the proofs for effectiveness in clinical trial, then that's what we're suggesting is these people will do the nasal spray where in between breaks when they're finishing their shift and make sure that if they got infected, the virus will be killed immediately. You're now in clinical trials in Canada. How are they going and when can we expect the results? The clinical trials uh, are going well. We started in British Columbia, but cases are very, very low in British Columbia. We moved quickly into Quebec. We have four different sites recruiting in Quebec, and the cases, the number of cases are, are higher there, so we're hoping to get this done quickly. It, is, it has two arms. One is a prevention arm with a control arm to it, and the other one is a small efficacy trial. So we look at people that are already infected early on in the disease and treat them. Are you going to be doing trials anywhere else apart from Canada? We are currently uh, applying for an IND in the US to do a, a trial in the US, which will be an early treatment trial. We're looking at uh, designing a trial right now for the UK as well. Now, COVID-19 is not the only disease that's caused by a coronavirus. So can sanitize be used against other diseases as well? Yes, I mean, as, as I mentioned, this, is, this was designed to be a flu prevention treatment. So every time when you go on a plane, when you go off the plane, you spray your nose and you make sure you don't get the flu. This will be, uh, nitric oxide kills any virus. For everything that we've seen so far, it is effective anti a very strong antimicrobial against bacteria and viruses and fungi. So if it's the flu or if it's the next pandemic that will unfortunately probably happen one day, this will work as well. So if the trials are successful, when can we expect to see sanitize on the pharmacy shelves? So what we are hoping for is within two to three months to complete the trial in Canada, go back to, to Health Canada, and use this data to ask for an expedited review and getting to a, what we call a phase four, getting it into the market, 
Once we show this, we believe the, the US as well will grant us an emergency use authorization to start selling it in the US and from there we'll go to the rest of the world. Thank you, Dr. Gili Regev from Sanitize.